Remember to click subscribe and notification button for more APA's video. Cooking APA. Hi, this is Cooking APA. Um, actually, today I feel a bit lazy and it's a little bit not so well, so I actually don't feel like cooking. But in the afternoon just now, I um, came into this person who actually sells Sun Hock, live Sun Hock. Okay, so uh, live Sun Hock is actually, for your information, is actually Apa's number one most favorite fish. The only thing is, it is so super expensive right now, easily 200 ringgit per kg if you eat it outside so and this person he is selling at uh, about 90 ringgit per kg uh, for a two kilo fish okay so immediately up our order from him <laughs> and he has arrived what you are looking at here is actually half of the fish actually slightly uh, slightly uh, lesser than half because this is the part i actually asked him to uh, uh, separate into two parts left and right for me and this is the part without the bone so this is actually a slightly uh, this is the about maybe 900 gram okay so um, this fish is very the, 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 the meat is very flaky very sweet very tender and definitely you will love this fish and the thing about this fish is you need to buy the larger ones um, the cheaper one is those around 1 kg which is normally can be found quite easily but this is about 2 kg which is actually getting lesser if you can find those 4 or 5 kg even better <laughs> so this is my number one fish yeah gobi fish sun hock um, so um, let's look at our ingredient here I'm going to do a steam it using a Hong Kong style we will need some uh, I have some this is the white portion of the green onion and few slices of ginger and then this is some uh, cut coriander fresh coriander and then this is some fried uh, garlic okay so let's uh, prepare our fish for steaming so what we can do here is below the fish we can actually I want we need to raise the fish so that the fish will be able to steam uh, more evenly so I'm going to use my green onion Alright, see? My fish is already raised Then I'm going to put Some uh, ginger slices Actually I seldom buy live fish But yeah, so I, have to, I think I have to apologize to this fish Okay. All right. So few slices, oops, few slices of uh, old ginger there, and we could give it some salt. A little bit of salt. Okay. And. We can send it for steaming. First rule, your steamer must be boiling, okay? Make sure your bo your water is boiling hot. Okay, then we can carefully move our fish over. <laughs> Actually, this fish is just like, just like I can hardly close. Uh, <laughs> slightly too long. Okay, then I'm going to close the lid. And we are going to use high heat to steam in for about some, this is half of the fish, probably about seven, seven minutes. Okay, seven minutes, we'll come back. While waiting for the fish to be steamed, we don't waste our time. We can make the steamed fish sauce. Okay, uh, let's start with some, I'm going to start with some garlic oil. If you don't have garlic oil, you can use sesame oil as well. Okay, about one tablespoon. Half a cup, this cup. Okay, half cup of uh, Saoxing wine. Okay. 
for one tablespoon of light soya sauce. A little bit of fish sauce. Oops, Ooh, too much. Just a little bit enough. Fish sauce is very, very salty. And I'm going to add a little bit of salt. Just a little bit of salt. A little bit of sugar. I have some fish stock, uh, sorry, uh, chicken stock. If you don't have chicken stock, you can also add some hot water up to you, it's okay. I have some chicken stock, put inside. Okay, probably about three, four tablespoons of chicken stock or uh, water. Few dashes of white pepper. Then we can actually mix it up nicely. Uh, I think I can put in a bit of oyster sauce. Okay, about one teaspoon of tablespoon uh, oyster sauce. Make sure everything is nicely uh, dissolved, including the salt and sugar. If you prefer the color to be darker, you can add some uh, dark soya sauce if you like. It's optional. Okay, our steamed fish sauce is done. So just wait for the fish to get ready. This is my uh, fish steaming under medium high heat for the past close to 7 minutes. Oh, look at how beautiful it is. Look at how flaky it is and how whitish the color is. Oh my god. Now, you see all this fishy water? We don't want all this fishy water, okay? So um, let's use, uh, just get something very sharp to test whether it is fully cooked or not. Put it in. If it cannot, if it can go through easily, then it's fully cooked. Here, this part is very thick, yeah? It, it still cannot go through yet. This part can, a little bit, okay? I think we need another, about, give it another a minute or two, okay? It must be able to get through, then only it means it is fully cooked. Let's give it another a minute or two. After another one and a half minute, it should be fully cooked by now, let me see. Yep, easily go through, easily go through. Let me see here. Easily go through, easily go through, yes, 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 yes. Okay, fully cooked. Get off the fire right now. Be careful with the steaming heat, yeah? It's very, very hot. Okay, then we can, uh, I will move this to the side and slowly move the fish over. Let me see. Okay. Let me adjust the angle for you. Okay, I'm going to move the fish over very, very carefully. Um, let me see. You don't want to spoil the fish, so you want to do it very carefully. Uh, I think I need to get another one to help. Right, I have moved my fish over, so now let's uh, pour our fish, steamed fish sauce over the fish. Alright. Fried garlic. Fresh coriander. It's basically done. So I hope you like my video. Uh, I'm very happy today to have managed to buy this fish. Uh, I've been waiting for a long time. Not easy to find. Really not easy to find. It so happened that this uh, restaurant, uh, due to the uh, movement control order, they actually closed their operation. So the boss 
wanted to uh, dispose of all the fish in his restaurant while they are still fresh. Okay, so uh, if you like my video, do share my video on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking Up Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Up YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Bye bye.